Hi, this is Josh Wright, sales manager here at Allen Chevrolet Cadillac of Monroe, and thank you so much uh, for your interest in this beautiful 2016 Chevy Suburban uh, LTZ. Uh, this vehicle has about 45,000 miles and is in fantastic shape. I'm um, doing this video because we have had several people inquire online. Um, hasn't been detailed on the interior just yet, but overall it's definitely a clean vehicle. So just doing this video to point out you know, anything that I would want to know before coming out and, and considering this vehicle. So we're going to start off here right in the front. Uh, this is actually um, a metallic kind of a pearl white so it's not just your flat summit white this is incandescent pearl white pearl um, video may not do it much justice but when you catch it in the right light uh, it's a really nice color front headlamps are in great shape no fogging or anything like that this does have the blacked out bow tie package so it just brings it all nice together got the full chrome grill in the front fog lamps I don't see any stone chips or anything like that. A couple of bug spots, but like I said, hasn't been detailed just yet. It was just traded in, um, but nothing I would be too concerned about. Uh, this vehicle does offer a 20-inch uh, chrome aluminum alloy wheel. Continental tires on it. Um, like I said, it hasn't gone through inspection just yet. Looks like there is some tread left on the tire. Don't know what that measures out to be yet. Kind of just getting a few different angles of the vehicle. Just trying to see if I can see any door dings or anything like that um, everything seems to be in really good shape move on do a little quick look at the interior here on the passenger side uh, it is a black leather interior these are heated as well as cooled uh, as you can see they're in great shape no signs of you know tearing ripping or anything like that this is probably the most worn spot on there and everything is still good Looks like they have the original window sticker, although it's not in that great a shape. Um, but you can quickly see that was the original price of this, this vehicle. It does have all the manual and everything else like that in there. So this is the 223 configuration. So you have two bucket seats in the front row, uh, two bucket seats in the second row, which gives you a nice pass through to get access. Uh, to the third row which seats three so a total of seven passengers can sit in this vehicle comfortably you can See that it does have a sunroof Has the rear DVD navigator the rear DVD uh, system and it also has one for the third row as well There's also a 110 volt AC outlet here. You have heated seats in the second row, and here's a couple inputs for the screens if you wanted to manually hook up like a video game system or something along that lines. Like I said, interior is in great shape. Wheels are in great shape. Tread depth is about even all the way around. So there's a little, it's a really small thing there I believe this has a trailering package it's just actually this underneath this beauty cover it does feel like it I believe it is let's see there we go sorry about that uh, but it does have the trailering receiver and everything like that right here and then this cover actually just goes over it uh, so you don't have to look at it all the time unless you're using it, it does have a power lift gate so we'll go ahead and open that up And the biggest benefit of a Suburban over a Tahoe is what you're looking at right now, the additional cargo space in addition to the third row. Now, if you're using it for just cargo, it does have folding seats. Oops, wrong one. There we go. So that's actually power. Just press these buttons right there. And it will fold down flat. I think that one, the seatbelt's in the way, but you get the idea. And you can fold them back up. Kind of a cool feature to have. Lots of storage space in addition to that second row, or excuse me, the third row being folded down as well. Oops. That's my fault. I hit it twice. <laughs> um, moving on to the driver's side of the vehicle. Just looking at a few different angles here. I mean, honestly, this thing's probably like a 9.5 out of 10. I, I really don't see anything... It's glaring out at me as far as condition-wise. 
you could definitely tell it was a well-kept vehicle. So it does have passive entry as well, so that basically that means that you have a key fob here. You can press this button to lock or unlock it. No need to bring your keys out. It does have memory seats here. Obviously power windows, power locks, power mirrors, of course. You do have a power seat on the driver's side. Interior is in great shape. It does have a heads-up display. Uh, automatic headlamps. It does have automatic 4x4 as well. This is for the adjustable pedals, traction control, rear park assist, and then lane keep assist as well. That's kind of a nice feature to have. It does have a power steering wheel. Let's go ahead and start the vehicle up here. You can see 45,772 miles on the vehicle currently. Got a nice cockpit area, so this is where just a little bit. Uh, you have heated as well as cooled seats here. Uh, you got a charging outlet, a couple of USB ports. You have two cup holders here. This is actually a wireless charging device for your cell phone. And lots of storage in here as well. This is for your rear HVAC, so people in the back. You have a CD player right here. Of course, your automatic HVAC, so you just set this to whatever temperature that you want, and it'll automatically heat or cool until it gets to that temperature. Turn this, down a bit. Um, this is kind of a cool feature. Hit this button, pops up, gives you a nice little cubby space if you want to store your cell phone in there with a USB charging port as well. Uh, this does have Bose Audio, AM, FM, XM radio. Um, I believe it has you have onboard navigation, so. It's also Android Auto and Apple CarPlay capable as well. So if you plugged your phone in, uh, you can use that for, um, you know, navigation or reading off your voicemails or text messages and things like that. So. So as of right now, the vehicle is still available. If you have any questions or concerns, feel free to give me a call. Again, this is Josh Wright, sales manager here at uh, Allen Chevrolet Cadillac of Monroe. My direct line is 734-621-4759, 734-621-4759. Again, it's Josh Wright. Thanks so much for watching.